Pennsylvania counties have just one week to finish recounting ballots to see who wins the Republican nomination for Senate. Just 910 votes separate Dr. Mehmet Oz and David McCormick. Hundreds of mail-in ballots were the center of a court case in Commonwealth Court in Harrisburg today. And as Chris Hoffman reports, state law is contradicting federal law. Much of what was discussed in court was pretty much splitting hairs. But when the margin between the two candidates is razor thin, every vote will matter. Right now, the difference between the two leading candidates is 0.7% of the vote, or 922 votes, according to the Department of State. The issue is mail-in ballots that were in on time but not dated. Dave McCormick, who is trailing, filed the lawsuit, while Dr. Oz's campaign is against counting the ballots. Pitt political science professor Chris Bono says politics always play a role. And so there's always a little bit of politics here. I have no doubt that if the situation was reversed, the candidates would have opposite positions. PA law says you must have a date for the mail-in ballot to count. But just last week, the U.S. Third Circuit Court ruled that was not material in qualifying a vote or not. So it ruled these ballots should be counted, causing a contradiction between a federal ruling and state law. But the more steps you have, the more likely it is that voters are going to make a mistake. Um, and forget to do one of the things that, that they need to do. For about three and a half hours, the McCormick campaign and Dr. Oz campaign argued about whether the ballots should count or not. The state also argued for the ballots to count, but the state GOP argued against it. After the arguments and rebuttals, the court adjourned without making a decision today by the judge. I mean, I think they'd want to make a decision relatively soon because I mean, we have to wrap this election up. The recount will begin in Allegheny County tomorrow. Look for more coverage on air and online. Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.